Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to Beer Geek Nation. I'm your host, Chris, for Pumpkin Beer Week Part 2. We're doing five days of pumpkin beers this week, and we're going to start with a big one. This is from Sam Adams. It's part of their Batch 1 series. This is their Fat Jack Imperial Double Pumpkin Ale coming in at 8.5% alcohol by volume. It's your standard, standard Imperial Pumpkin Ale brewed with pumpkin, cinnamon, ginger, nutmeg, and allspice. And the trick to this one is they use smoked malts in it, which is going to be really interesting. Sam Adams puts out a couple pumpkin beers this time of year so this is a new one for them so with that said let me get into a glass that you guys know how it smells tastes and give me the final verdict on fat jack from sam adams all right guys so the appearance on the fat jack you know it looks a lot like a belgian double maybe a really light brown ale there's mahogany colors in there a really really dark plum or maybe like a blood red it's a pretty clear beer i can see the light through it nice carbonation coming up from the bottom of the glass there was maybe a half a finger of a kind of a brownish khaki head on there big bubbles decent amount of lacing not getting too much alcohol uh, legs on this one just a, a pretty strange looking pumpkin beer i guess all right the aroma the fat jack well, that's really, really interesting. There's a lot of dark fruits right in the front of this one. You know, that fig, raisin, uh, Belgian kind of quad or double type of smells. A little bit of gin ginger, a little bit of that cinnamon, a little bit of nutmeg. Touch of smoke. There's definitely kind of a sweet cherry smoke to this. Yeah, it's a really, really interesting smelling pumpkin beer. All right, here's the taste on the Fat Jack. Cheers. Yeah, that is definitely a strange one. Right at the front of the tongue, there's a touch of like a twang of bitterness followed immediately by dark fruits. It reminds me a lot of like a Belgian double. You're getting plum, cherry, raisin, fig, those big kind of sweet, dark, juicy fruits in there. Middle of the mouth, a little bit of cinnamon, a little bit of nutmeg, really kind of starts to coat the mouth. This beer has a lot of body to it. Again, more of like a Belgian double. There's a nice biscuity quality to it. A little bit of smokiness in there, playing off the sweetness from like the dark fruits and the cinnamon. Kind of a sweet aftertaste, more of that dark fruitiness kind of in the aftertaste. It's a really, really strange beer. It's almost like a Belgian double pumpkin beer hybrid. Kind of weird. All right, guys, so the final verdict on the Samuel Adams Fat Jack Double Pumpkin, 8.5%. This is part of their Batch 1 series, so it is a limited run. Guys, I'm going to give this one a B-. minus. To be completely honest, I'm a little bit disappointed. I was expecting kind of a big imperial style, you know, pumpkin pie type of uh, pumpkin beer, and I'm not getting that at all, and I'm not really getting any pumpkin out of this one. I get more of a Belgian double. I get dark fruits and a breadiness, a nice kind of uh, caramely sweetness in there, a little bit of nutmeg, a little bit of ginger, that smokiness does add you know something to the beer but I just don't know that I would really classify this as like a you know imperial pumpkin ale so it's kind of a weird beer a little bit all over the place a little bit disjointed never really does anything for me but with that said it's pretty solid um, I just don't think this is one that I would go to for you know an imperial pumpkin style ale like your pumpkin and the smash pumpkin and stuff like that so with that said gonna get a B minus for me and remember folks life's too short. Drink amazing beers. Cheers.